Section twenty three of Goblin Market and Other Poems by Christina Rossetti. This LibriVox recording is in the public domain. Maud Clare. Out of the church she followed them with a lofty step and mien. His bride was like a village maid, Maud Clare was like a queen. Son Thomas, his lady mother said, with smiles almost with tears. May Nell and you but live as true as we have done for years. Your father thirty years ago had just your tale to tell. But he was not so pale as you, nor I so pale as Nell. My lord was pale with inward strife, and Nell was pale with pride. My lord gazed long on pale Maud Clare, or ever he kissed the bride. Lo! I have brought my gift, my lord, have brought my gift, she said, to bless the hearth, to bless the board, to bless the marriage bed. Here's my half of the golden chain you wore about your neck, that day we waded ankle deep for lilies in the beck. Here's my half of the faded leaves we plucked from budding bough. With feet amongst the lily leaves, the lilies are budding now. He strove to match her scorn with scorn, he faltered in his place. Lady, he said, Maud Clare, he said, Maud Clare, and hid his face. She turned to Nell. My lady Nell, I have a gift for you. Though were it fruit, the bloom were gone, or were it flowers, the dew. Take my share of a fickle heart, mine of a paltry love. Take it or leave it as you will, I wash my hands thereof. And what you leave, said Nell, I'll take, and what you spurn I'll wear. For he's my lord for better and worse, and him I love, Maud Clare. Yea. Though you're taller by the head, more wise and much more fair, I'll love him till he loves me best, me best of all, Maud Clare. End of section twenty three.